safely back home. And Steve's getting his hands dirty for a good cause in the lead up to the Tamworth Country Music Festival. Sort of the extreme bull riding stuff last Friday and Saturday night. So that was um, out of the rodeo grounds. And um, yeah, since then we did another bull ride thing Saturday and then um, and then we just had a couple of little sort of media things and that on. So it's been good. We actually had a bit of a play up on Saturday night, which was, which was a nice change. Later we're doing a show tonight out of the track and Lee Kearney is coming out and doing support for us. So that's going to be, um, that's going to be really good. <laughs> After leaving an impression, Steve moves on to a meet and greet with fans who've made the pilgrimage to Tamworth. Just in case I forget my name, I can sit here and say, G'day, I'm Steve. And there are plenty of fans keen to meet yes, Steve. Was. Excellent. No worries. Cheers. Just dig him up. Just dig him up. Here we go. This one here. Here's trouble. How you going, mate? That's good. Brody, Country Music Channel. Country Music Channel, Brody. This is this is the Flanders' biggest fan right here. He's our favourite fan. He comes out to the shows. Look at that. Wow. We... Finally, it's back to the Tamworth Entertainment Centre. We're doing a show here tonight and <laughs> Lee Kernigan's supporting us, so we let him sound check first and then we're on, so. <laughs> and it's no surprise that Steve is as involved in the sound check as he is with everything else. Yeah, OK. We'll see if it picks up. Okay. So. Is everybody else happy down there? Straight from the sound check, and he's into the setup for the next gig. It's full steam ahead on the Flangemobile. After that, then it's back again. I think going to be like seven of us piled in here, and we'll scoot back. Just say he's going to move the bus around and, and get around, because because we're sort of running so late. On the way back, it's going to be real tight between gigs. We don't get off stage at Kearney until like 10 to 9. You've got to be on stage over there at 9, so it's going to be really, really tight. Right, up. see ya. Yeah, you got done, Speed. So we're all under these covers here trying not to get it done. We got done for no seatbelts as well. It was licensed, gone. Find, find a new bus driver. It's back to the Kernigan gig for the final preparations. A quick check of the set list and a chat with the soundies. And then it's showtime. Hey, mate, if they throw Molly Meldrum out of America, how can they let you in? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Yeah. You're gonna you know, I, I like to think I've got just a couple more morals under the hat than old Molly to tell you the truth. <laughs> Ooh, that'll get back. <laughs> Another day and another TV appearance at the biggest country music festival in the country. Forget the flange mobile. This is the Ford mobile in promotional overdrive. I had like 35 stitches down through here. Like, I didn't break the bone, I don't think I got away with it. Okay, straight into the question, Steve. Right up. I'll cut. Good. G'day, this is Steve Ford. G'day, this is Steve Ford. Two in the bag. Two in the bag. G'day, this is Steve Ford. Didn't get done till about five in the morning or something. We um, were up just sitting around having a bit of a chin wag and a bullshit with a couple of people. So, but no, it was it was a good night actually. We just had an early start again this morning, so run a little bit late as per usual. But you know, that's me. <laughs> Stop that. Get that? Um, yeah, yeah. Like, that's, that's a good, good one. That's in your ears, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. Well, that's five out of seven in the can, isn't it? That's just trying to organise all these clowns, you know. Too much to do on them, only one person. It's a problem. Well, that's that for the Meet the Press cattle call. And watch this. Steve's off to kick back in the flange mobile. Nope, no rest for the wicked. Next, world domination. So stay tuned for more rockin' in Tamworth.